The whispers of plastic, a silent crisis in every sip. If you're old enough, you might remember a time when bottled drinks came in sturdy, recyclable glass. It was heavier, more prone to breaking, but undeniably classic. Then came plastic, a material that revolutionized industries. It was lightweight, shatterproof, and most importantly, cheap. For companies, it meant lower production costs and greater convenience. For consumers, it meant accessibility like never before. Overnight, plastic bottles became the standard. No longer did we worry about broken glass or the weight of carrying drinks. It seemed like a win for everyone. But like every trade-off, the hidden costs of this switch would emerge, casting a long shadow over the modern era of convenience. Today, every sip from a plastic bottle contains more than just water. It carries whispers of an industrial legacy that's reshaping our bodies, our ecosystems and our planet. The Invisible Feast. What's lurking in your water? Imagine drinking from what feels like the pinnacle of purity, a sealed bottle of water. Yet inside, beyond the liquid's clarity, exists an invisible feast of plastic. Recent research has revealed that with every sip, you could be ingesting 240,000 microplastic fragments per litre. That's roughly the equivalent of swallowing a pinch of plastic confetti. What makes this discovery so alarming is the size of these fragments. Microplastics, typically less than 5 millimetres, are troubling enough. But many studies now focus on nanoplastics, particles smaller than a micrometre, invisible to the naked eye, yet capable of penetrating cellular barriers. Their small size and sheer abundance make them almost impossible to avoid. How do these particles end up in your water? It's the bottle itself. The very material designed to hold your drink begins to break down as soon as it's manufactured. Sunlight, heat, and even the friction during transport contribute to the degradation of plastic bottles. Over time, these processes release microscopic fragments into the water they're supposed to protect. The result is that what seems like a pristine drink is anything but. Chemical Hitchhikers, the Silent Passengers. The story doesn't end with the particles. Microplastics are far from inert. Think of them as tiny Trojan horses carrying a payload of harmful chemicals. Inside each fragment are residues of BPA, a chemical known to mimic estrogen and disrupt the hormonal system. Alongside BPA are phthalates, which have been linked to reproductive issues, developmental delays and metabolic diseases. But there's more. Plastics often contain additives like stabilizers, colorants and plasticizers. These chemicals, designed to make plastic durable and flexible, don't always stay in place. Over time, they leach out, contaminating the water inside. Furthermore, as plastic particles travel through the environment, they can absorb external pollutants, like pesticides and industrial toxins, becoming even more dangerous by the time they reach your bottle. This chemical cocktail infiltrates your body sip by sip, accumulating silently over time. While the immediate effects may be hard to notice, the long-term consequences could ripple through generations. Perhaps the most unnerving aspect of this story is the ability of nanoplastics to traverse biological barriers. These tiny invaders have been shown to cross the intestinal lining and even the blood-brain barrier, a tightly controlled gateway designed to protect the brain from harmful substances. Once inside, they interact with cells in ways we're only beginning to understand. Laboratory studies suggest that nanoplastics can trigger inflammatory responses and oxidative stress. Processes linked to chronic illnesses like cardiovascular disease, diabetes and neurodegenerative disorders such as Alzheimer's. Consider this, a 2022 study confirmed the presence of microplastics in human blood for the first time. These findings suggest that no part of our body is immune. The particles travel through the bloodstream, potentially accumulating in organs and tissues. Could this explain the rise in unexplained health conditions? The answer remains elusive, but the implications are chilling. The consequences of our reliance on plastic extend far beyond personal health. Every year, over 300 billion plastic bottles are produced globally. While some are recycled, the majority end up in landfills or the natural environment. There, they break down into microplastics that contaminate soil, rivers and oceans. 
In the marine ecosystem, microplastics are ingested by fish, shellfish and even plankton, the foundation of the ocean's food chain. These tiny particles accumulate as they move up the food chain, ultimately landing on our plates in the form of seafood. Studies have found microplastics in sea salt, honey and even beer. The ubiquity is staggering, but the impact isn't limited to ingestion. Marine life suffers physically, often mistaking plastic for food. Once ingested, these particles block digestive systems, lead to starvation, and disrupt reproductive cycles. The effects ripple across ecosystems, threatening biodiversity and the balance of life in the oceans. It's a cycle we can no longer ignore. The plastic we discard returns to us, reshaped into invisible threats. The good news, we can act. The first step is awareness. By understanding the scope of the problem, we can make informed choices that protect our health and the environment. Here's how you can start. Ditch single-use plastics. Invest in reusable bottles made from stainless steel or glass. Filter your water. Home filtration systems can reduce exposure to microplastics and other contaminants. Advocate for change. Support policies that limit plastic production and invest in sustainable alternatives. Recycle responsibly. While recycling isn't a perfect solution, it's a critical step in reducing waste. Individual efforts may seem small, but collectively they can create a ripple effect that challenges industries and inspires innovation. Plastic bottles promised us convenience, but they've delivered a hidden crisis. From the fragments that infiltrate our bodies to the environmental destruction they leave behind, their legacy is far-reaching. The whispers of plastic are growing louder. Will we listen or will we continue to sip on this silent crisis? Let's continue the conversation. What changes will you make today? Share your thoughts below. Until next time, stay curious, stay informed and remember every choice matters.